for Jalen Rose. And how about Artest getting back to break that up? Ron Artest with great hustle. Here's Mike Bibby. Stops, pops, yes. And boy, give one of those bounce back after that game that he had Friday night in Boston with a 14 first half point. Well, Mike really looking for his shot early and knocked down that mid-range shot. Uh, moving well without the basketball. Ron Artest finds Mike in the corner for the short three. Mike able to penetrate to the basket with the left hand. No challenge at the hoop. So Mike is scoring all the ways that you're used to see Mike score, driving the ball to the basket, getting to the line, uh, making the three ball as well. So 58. Here's Bibby. And Mike Bibby with a big basket. Mike Bibby a three. And Mike Bibby now with 20 points. And he gets the key. And free throws as the Raptors are in the penalty. See Mike Bibby just a real quick uh, face up and uh, shoots the ball before the defense can adjust. I think. Brad Miller walks all the way in. They got Mike James guarding Sharif Abdul-Rahim and Jerry the Kings can't get the ball can't, to him. Can't get the ball to him. Uh, Mike Bibby scoops to the hoop and it counts. Oh, Great there's point. no way he could have defended him two months ago before the injury and yeah. everything that's happened to Sharif. Uh, wasn't able to stay in front of Bosch. Nobody else rotated even to help. Uh, that was way too easy. Here's Bibby, a look from downtown. Yes. And Kings will get the ball to start the fourth quarter, so we'll see how they execute here on their final possession of the third. Same spot, same result. Mike Bibby. It was an instant replay. <laughs> I mean, uh, why not? Uh, Mike Bibby putting on a shooting display like this. Splash from long range now Brad Miller again finds Mike and it's another splash down from long range for the Bibby Mike Bibby doing the uh, three ball dance step here a little uh, perimeter shot early on now Ron Artest finds Mike in the deep corner for the long ball Mike and you see uh, using the left hand to finish but more importantly knocking down that long ball two straight times in here in the third quarter which really brought his team back and uh, just absolutely has the throw going inside, outside, all around the town. Mike Bibby, you know, get, you know once you see the double team come, move the ball. Don't wait till it gets there. It doesn't make any difference where you move the basketball. Just move it. You know, Mike Bibby's moving it. He's moving it right to the basket. And through the net, 31 for Mike Bibby. <laughs> and, uh, so does Bibby have a big shot at him? Here's our test. And he puts it up with the left hand. He's got 15. Remember that play if the Kings win it. Here's our test. And he puts it up. Put it in the book. That's the hit of the line. Oh! Guys rebounding pretty good for someone that doesn't rebound very well ordinarily in terms of numbers. I think he's one of those guys. And we see Mike Bibby knocks down a big hoop. Knows it. Uh, Sacramento. What a finish here from the ACC. Bibby to tie. Mike Bibby. Oh! Can you believe that shot? That's from 26 feet away. And we're tied at 108. Now watch a nice little step back jump shot in the paint and Mike Bibby no, no hesitation under control now the big three ball good screen from Brad Miller Mike pulls up at 26 and it's splash time in Toronto another look at it James looks at the screen that loses his concentration defensively Mike Bibby with the clutch shot turns to the fans and said yes I got a big heart I'll do it again Kevin Mark plenty of time don't panic Unbelievable clutch shot, as you said, enough time, but that's a tough shot. Mike Bibby's just the kind of guy, he wants to take those tough shots. He did. Watch the reaction. Yes, clutch man comes through. Kings really did not do a good job in that offensive sequence, but it doesn't make any difference when you got Mr. Clutch.